Razak and Umar Akmal were outstanding. Leading edge and out. Gutdell's gone. Not the start the Black Caps needed. Leading edge from Gupto and Shazad takes the catch at point. Well, what a wonderful strike from uh, Abdul Razak. He's been striking the ball magnificently with the bat, but now he's struck with the ball, and what a costly scalp. Gupton, who's been in great silky touch. But they can't afford to get bogged down nice and early. They're going to need a big contribution at the top of the order. It's up in the air. Jesse Wright has hit the straight up. Who's going to take the catch? Shazad again, can't keep him out of the game. Takes an excellent catch. Everyone stands around and watches him. And all of a sudden, New Zealand are two for two. Created quite a drama in the end out of uh, nothing. Amit Shazad, it went high up in the air. Another disappointing end to uh, Jesse Ryder's intentions. And knock. They are trying to flick the ball over mid-wicket in no position to play that one. Skyed up in the air. And Amit Shazad, uh, a dramatic take in the end. Making a straightforward. Driven by Brownlee, and he'll get one. He's going to have to hurry to the head. All of a sudden, this is going to be very close. Shahid Afridi has hit from side on, and I think Dean Brownlee's in big trouble. Wow, what a strike! And Shahid Afridi, I think he knows that he has got the big one here. Direct hit, and I think the decision pending has got to favour Pakistan there. Picked up the ball early, and a shot at the stumps, hitting the bullseye, and he was not even in the frame, really. Wickets are broken. New Zealand dreams being shattered here up front. Third wicket has to go down. Courtesy, brilliant piece of uh, cricket from... Very good catches. Oh, he's hit in front. Oh, he's been given. Chris Gaffney says that Razak is on fire. He's got rid of the New Zealand skipper. LBW just nipped back. And Taylor has to make his way back. He may not be pissy, but he's a mighty clever, Abdul Razak. And he can seem it either way. Ross Taylor doesn't look too pleased with this one. I think he played across the line. Possibly just a little high, who knows, but... It uh, looked standing with the bat was brutal with the bat. And now he's doing a great job with the ball. Franklin's bold. Decides to charge Razak. Doesn't get anything on it. And his stumps are all over the place. Another one gone for New Zealand. What a day he's having up to Razak. He's all smiles. Too hot to handle. Keeping it nice and simple. Bowling wicket to wicket and disrupting the bales and the flow of the New Zealanders. Glacian will be innovative. We'll try something a bit different here. They tried something different. He's out. Went for the reverse lap and it's not his night tonight. He's got to go. Ramad picks up the first of his wickets. Oh, well, I'm sure we're looking for more. One for two. 36 for six now, New Zealand. Oh boy, boy, oh boy. Well, it worked for him the other night, Hamilton. Not tonight. Just dragged it onto a stump, so McGlashan goes for seven. New Zealand slipped to 36 for six. That's closer, that's closer and it's out, yep. Yeah, you could see middle and leg this time, as opposed to middle and off. That one going on to hit, probably middle. playing cute cricket or trying to play cute cricket. Nathan McCullum went across the stumps and he really had to play that one because uh, otherwise he was dead and he was well placed. Bottom gone! This time Styrus goes and up goes the finger from Boom Boom Afridi. Well, that could be a game set and match for Pakistan because Scott Styrus was the last real hope, the real hero for New Zealand. He missed the ball, head up high in the air, missed the ball. Afridi didn't miss the stumps. He's been good tonight. Can hit the ball hard, can hit it long. Oh, oh, straight through him. How quick was that? That is a ripper from Afridi. 134 kph. Fancy playing that first up. Too good for Southie. Wow, <laughs> what pace from Shahid Afridi. 
I think he indicated to the keeper that it's going to be a fast one and we know that Shad Afridi's quicker one is a real quick delivery. Almost as quick as Shrey Bakhtar. Saudi clearly late on that one, clearly surprised by that. What's this one going to be? Slow, bowls him! I think that might have been the wrong one, so he's got the tricks as well. Gets it with a googly, New Zealand all out for 80. Pakistan are on the board, their tour is underway. Well, that was a slow one again from Afridi, who's been outstanding tonight. And it was the wrong one, look at this. Hit leg stump, Mills nowhere near it. And that really sums up New Zealand's night. And Afridi ends up with 4 for 14.